This was a shock to many people, right? So it's safe to say very few knew the name Paul Rubens, whereas just about everyone knew Pee Wee Herman, a bona fide pop cultural phenomenon who shot to fame in the 1980s for his silly comedy that transcended age. He still looked the same. He still looked like Pee Wee Herman at 70 that he did when he was 30. Uh, he transcended uh, generations. Uh, everyone loved Pee Wee Herman, young, old. His comedy. His Variety TV editor Michael Schneider there describes Pee Wee Herman as the godfather of alternative comedy. It all started with the Pee Wee Herman show that debuted at a Los Angeles theater in 1981. That, of course, led to a slot on Saturday, Saturday morning TV with Pee Wee's Playhouse. It ran for five seasons, earned 22 Emmys. And in 1985, made it to the big screen with Pee Wee's Big Adventure. The character of an overgrown child with a tight gray suit, red bow tie, and unforgettable laugh is cherished around the globe. But Schneider says perhaps even more meaningful to Southern California. If you go back and watch Pee Wee's Big Adventure, he starts out that adventure in Santa Monica. You know, it's uh, the, he's very much uh, became an Angelino. Uh, the Groundlings uh, claims him as one of their early stars. And yeah, he developed Pee Wee Herman as a character right here in L.A. and turned him into a, a, a timeless, iconic character. The iconic character suffered a career setback in 1991 when Rubens was arrested for indecent exposure. And in 2001, another arrest for possession of child pornography. But the allegation was reduced to an obscenity charge. He never served any time. Over the years, he made a comeback, mostly playing non-Pee Wee characters. His Instagram today broke the news to fans that he died after he, quote, bravely and privately fought cancer for years with his trademark tenacity and wit. For six years, it turns out, he battled cancer. And the outpouring of love today from the likes of Jimmy Kimmel and director Guillermo del Toro speaks to the legacy he leaves behind. Paul Rubens was 70 years old.